right, we're going to do a quick review of Isle of Man Right on the Edge. So I think this is the first time a full Isle of Man TT game has ever come out. I think there was a, there's a few games and there's a few games that have little portions of the Isle of Man, but I think this is the first one that has the full full total course. There might have been um, on the PS3 there was one Isle of Man TT game, but um, I wasn't very good at all. But this game I think is amazing. I've been waiting for a game like this to come out forever, and here it is. Um, the menu system very well done, easy to navigate. Um, you can change all the you know standard options. Uh, you can jump into a game really quick. You don't have to go through um, a bunch of stuff. Um, even out of the box, you just quick race, and hey, you can jump right on the uh, main course and uh, start racing. So I thought they did an awesome job on that. The bikes look incredible. Um, one of the biggest things I like about this too is the sound. They did an incredible job on the sound, so I would definitely give them thumbs up for that. I know the MotoGP series have been struggling with uh, the sound, I think, for years, um, but I think they did an amazing job on this. You can jump right in, like I say, and uh, choose your course. So if you look at there's the full course, um, or if you want, you can go on uh, and just find different laps. So if we'll go back to here, quick start, and then um, right here you can just choose different sections that they've uh, tied off and uh, jump right into any section or like I said go through the whole course uh, beautiful beautiful game I thought they did such an amazing job on this so let's go let's, let's jump on one here and if you look back here the uh, the start the mass start um, that's just where they put everybody on the line and go it's kind of fun they don't do that in real life uh, or you can do the TT start where you start one behind the other uh, you can change the time of day which is cool too I like to do the noon and then you can jump right into um, a super sport or super bike I always like to go super bike and I really think they did an incredible job on these bikes and whoever did the UI for the um, for the display the heads-up display looks incredible so let's go ahead and take a, a ride on this um, and this is the ps4 version and it was originally 59.99 when it came out and i seen it, i was like man i gotta get that um, and then it came on a flash sale i think it was 29 and i normally wait for games to go down even further um, but i wanted to support the people who made this because i think they did a great job and like i said i've always been waiting for uh, a game like this to come out the isle of man tt and it finally has and so not only has it but they did such an amazing job especially when you um, look at the speed I mean you really feel like you're going you know 150 160 miles an hour on this thing so we'll take a in-game preview here Oh yeah, it's <laughs> it takes some concentration to get used to, but um, if you sit there and just really concentrate and get into the game, oh, it is it is amazing. Just imagine that you're there. Oh, but one little one small mistake and uh, you go off. But um, another cool thing about it is the wind. Once you start going faster, you start hearing the wind. Oh, just a little, just a little, one minor mistake, and you're gone. And they have different views, of course, the, all the standard views. Um, I like the onboard, definitely looks the coolest. And I think even on the windscreen, as you're going through the course, uh, bugs will start appearing on the windscreen, you know, like you hit bugs, it's smeared on there. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely takes an enormous amount of concentration, and, I, and it's gonna take a long time to learn the course, uh, learn every little nuance and I remember I, I was younger I, I'd watch Mike Hellwood when he would race on this course and one time he came out of retirement and he did a video on on board video uh, coming out of retirement and uh, he, you know he'd talk about all the Gaelic names like uh, Quanky Molo um, and they have all those different sections in the course you know like going up on the mountain course so I would say to the developers, y'all did an amazing job. I really, really like this game. Have a lot of fun with it. Um, 
a lot of times before I go to bed, I'll just blast through some courses. Um, so I'd give you, I'd give you two thumbs up if you're thinking about buying it. If you haven't, go out, uh, pull the credit card, pull that plastic out of your wallet, and, and buy this beautiful game. Let me know what your comments are down, or what, if you have any comments down in the comments section. I'd love to hear if you bought it and if you like it.